Hello everyone and welcome to this Orbiter tutorial. Uh, this is my first English tutorial, so please go easy on me. Um, in this tutorial I will try to explain how to use Auto FCS. Uh, and this includes the installation of Auto FCS. There are some questions on the forum about uh, how you can install the software. So I will try to explain it uh, w what I think is the easiest way. There are many ways you can install it and uh, I will try to uh, do the easiest way for me. So the first thing we do is we go to, in to the internet. And then we go to one of the mirrors of uh, or bitter add-ons. I will post the link in the video description. Um, and then we search for the Shuttle Fleet KLC and Auto FCS upgrade. Uh, there are a couple of um, add-ons that we need prior to this one. Uh, that's the SCS payloads. We can find it on Orbit Hangar. Uh, the SCS payloads expansion pack, which we can find on Simviation. Uh, the Shuttle Fleet, also on Simviation and then this pack. I've already downloaded all the add-ons. <coughs> um, again, I will post all the required links in the video description. Um, so let's go and install all the add-ons. Uh, the first thing we need is a clean orbiter installation. Um, I already have a clean um, orbit installation. I, I kind of use this as a template. So I will just go ahead and copy and paste the whole folder. Just like that. So now we have a clean orbiter installation. Um, there is a specific order that you need to install the add-ons. First you need to install the SCS payloads, then the expansion pack, and then the shuttle fleet and then this pack. So we will just go ahead and install all the add-ons in this order. So um, first we are going to install the STS payloads. Just go ahead and copy and replace everything. Um, and then we need the SDS Payloads Expansion Pack. And just again go ahead and copy and replace everything. Alright. And then the uh, Shuttle Fleet itself. copy and replace and the final thing we are going to install is the add-on pack itself the shuttle fleet add-on pack just like that So basically we have installed all the required add-ons now. Um, one of the most important things uh, you need to do now is to edit your Orbiter config file. Uh, you can edit it in every um, TXT editor. Uh, I'm using Notepad++. So I will go ahead and open it. And we need to change this line. It's now um, saying false and we need to change it to true. And this was the the reason that the Auto FCS add-on didn't work anymore uh, in Orbiter 2010. So we can now open Orbiter. Uh, since this is a clean install, I need to do some checks. Uh, let's start with modules. I want all of these. Uh, the Auto FCS itself, we need the Auto FCS normal, not the auto F FCS STS, just the normal one. Um, do I need something else for now? I don't think so. Nope. 
uh, we'll go to video full screen 32 all right that's about it um, I'm going to start my uh, other video uh, recording software now and then we will launch uh, discovery with the MPLM to low earth orbit uh, and we will get it back on earth with auto FCS